getting into the February TAC pack, we've got everything here that was in the TAC pack plus. And where do we start? You know what? One of the new brands, uh, yeah, yeah. because it's kind of on your build. Yeah. I don't want to show too much. We've talked about this part over and over again. So CMMG has their zero line, which is kind of their upgraded Ambi, uh, really nice custom type stuff. We chose the CMMG Ambi mag release because it actually works. Um, so there's two sides to mag release, obviously, and Jared's build is down here. Usually when you press on the left side of the rifle for an AB mag release, it doesn't always drop the magazine because of the geometry. CMMG solved that. It's the first time we've worked with CMMG. They are a kick-ass company. Been doing a lot of great things for many years. Excited to see them in our box. Very honored, very excited about that. Because it's exciting. I don't know, it just gets me. I'm excited. I'm excited. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be, they're gonna they're gonna love that one. And honestly, the customers have been excited. By now, everyone has gotten their February pack. And weirdly, I keep getting the same email over and over. Everyone's like, this box is one of the best you've sent because right away I can put so much stuff to use. That's right. The mag button, among the other things we're gonna go over. Yeah. So it's been a really like positive experience going through the inbox and hearing from all of you how you know, I think the cold weather helps. Everyone's tinkering with their gun. Yeah. So this this is kind of a tinker box. There's a lot of stuff in here that you can utilize and play with your build while we're waiting for the, the weather to get better. Yeah, So we need better weather. Say that. that that's better, a tongue twister. We need a better weather. Better, better. I could do that in like a Beavis and Butthead if you want. <laughs> um, do you want to talk about the mag hammock? I do want to talk about the mag hammock. Yeah. Um, again, people talking in the email about I put everything to use right away, and this little item right here is something they are putting to use on their EDC right away. New company, Mag Hammock. Yes. They just hit us up and was like, hey, we saw TACPAC on Instagram. We'd love to get in the box, send the sample our way. USA made. Hardy. Hardy. When the sample showed up. And, and so, so it's strong in a hardy way. It's also lightweight. And like a lot of things, we have to find things that are universal enough for the thousands of subscribers that we have. Mm -hmm. So when we see an opportunity, like when you look at the construction of this thing and how this can fit virtually any pistol magazine, I'll bring it up to the camera in a moment. Um, it was a no brainer because we look at probably a dozen mag carriers a year. Is that fair? Oh, From yeah. Kydex to soft. And I think we did a Kydex last year mm -hmm. uh, from Lag Tactical, yep. if I'm not mistaken. Great people. And so we want to do a soft one that really super low profile. I'll bring it up to the camera. I'll show you guys. Lightweight material, but still strong material using steel, carbon fiber, and then this fabric. And then as you can see, there is a, a Velcro swatch on the inside of the fabric part. This can be made to fit any size magazine that would go and ride right on your belt. Perfect little unit, great feedback on this. And people always ask for EDC stuff mm -hmm. and name, you know, magazine holsters. Yep as one of the top requested items here at TACPAC. So really cool item. But JR, how do you know how to use the mag hammock? <laughs> well, you know me, I'm, I'm a packaging guy. I'm a art guy, you could say. Very artistic. Um, so I always pay attention to little details like this. And I love that the people at mag hammock did this. What do you call these things? QR code. QR code, yeah, I know so much about it. Yeah, little- I'm the art guy. <laughs> up on the biz terms. QR code, man, it's new, it's hip. Scan this thing, get instructions on how to do the adjustment feature on the mag hammock. Just a nice little touch. You probably can, I hold it? You probably can scan it's it. Inception, QR inception. Double QR. Pause it. We weren't really paused. We were, we were just thinking <laughs> it gotcha. the whole time. Gotcha, guys. <laughs> uh, so yeah, Conceal Craft, great brand. Uh, Really great to work with and mm -hmm. a very durable, but lightweight and low profile product. Next, Mission First Tactical Tumblr. We love working with Mission First. Tumblr is no exception, comes in a variety of styles. We sent out, I think, five different styles to the TACPAC community and uh, these things are really great. You can literally put ice and water or whiskey without ice, plug will it, you can put some, you could put a beverage of your choice in here 
and it will stay at the same temperature or similar temperature for a very long time. Plus, canteens are all the rage, we all know that, and you might as well have a cool one. Not trying to dog Stanley Cups, I just don't own one, and they're too big. <laughs> it doesn't make sense. Most backpacks have a nice little er to go in, and you're mobile, and you're moving, and we're moving. Mission First Tactical, really strong, really durable, you can throw it anywhere, wow. oh shit. And I'm gonna go grab it and put it on camera. That's gonna be fine. <laughs> it's gonna fall. It's gonna fall. You know, have you seen um, our Instagram people tagging their photos? Of yes, that? it's it's incredible. Yeah, people That's the people all the way to the right. Yeah, people really are liking it, having fun with it. They're funny. It's something, again, to your point, this is a box where you can tinker. You can take this out of the package and begin using it today. Mm -hmm. I really think you should hit it with the Katana to test the durability, yes, but yeah. maybe that's another video. Yeah. But anyway, mission first, tactical. Maybe Got your back on keeping your beverages cold or hot. Or lukewarm. Or whatever, whatever way you want them. <laughs> You know, I'm, there's a couple things I'm really excited about. Well, those are the plus. We'll leave the two plus items there's for the end. Two plus items for the end. Okay, you hold up your sticker, I'll hold up mine. <laughs> Funny guy. Thompson Targets, Puck Target. Again, we used the yellow ones last year. They're targets, targets are targets, but the reason these are so cool is they don't get ruined because they're in this little puck. That is the reason we use this is because you can throw this in the range bag and your targets aren't gonna get destroyed. How many times have you had targets in your bag and they get crumpled up, bent up, or especially on the shoot and see targets, it wears away the, the coating on the front so you can see that. This keeps them nice, it's tight, compact little unit. Throw it in your range bag and uh, you'll always have good fresh targets. Nice little, nice little throw in for the box. Mm -hmm. What about your sticker? Yeah, this month sticker, this guy just went into royalty. Why do free? I freaking is that what it is? forget words all the time? Like you can here. use it now and not get sued. I haven't had my Celsius yet. Oh, um, your second Celsius. Yeah. <laughs> what is the freaking word? Royalty free? No, it's not that. Trademark. It's in the copyright public domain. Public domain. <laughs> Rewind. <laughs> this month's sticker a character that was recently dropped into public domain. If you want to get into the details of what public domain is. I think I got means, this. It's okay, the take it. <laughs> domain in which the public uses. Got him. Sure. Legally. And Legally. Freely. Freely. So Steamboat Willie, I'm not going to get into all <laughs> people. Uh, are gonna, what I never are watched about? Mickey Mouse. <laughs> I don't know. Feedback's been really good. It's fun. You can watch I was Mickey watching Mouse. Airborne, dude, the uh, rollerblading movie. Airbud. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to talk about two more items. Uh, first and foremost, Walker's Active Ear Pro. It goes without saying, something we send once a year, Active Ear Pro. This year it made sense. We talked with the folks over at GSM Walker's and uh, got hooked up with a really great pair of active ear pro that is low profile enough slim, slim so that when you're shooting and sh or shouldering and uh shooting your rifle look at look at the profile mm -hmm. i'm gonna i'm gonna i'm gonna uh, come up here the word of the day is low profile check these things out they're stout but they're not too heavy they've got this really rigid headband that is really nice quality Boom. I like kind of the matte, the finish on them is really yeah. cool. Like just little details at little Walker's. Details. That's not, I don't know, I'm gonna come into the frame because I don't know what he's doing. He's doing like a mime thing. And that's why I really like him. Well, but that's not, because they can, that's <laughs> fine. It was good while it lasted, okay? <laughs> I, <laughs> cool. Rate in the comments if we're having too much fun on this month's <laughs> unboxing. Because I assure you that JR is. Is there something else There's in this month's one box? One more. Big things come in small packages. I'm gonna bring this up to the camera, but I gotta tell you, Forward Controls Design makes some of the most top quality products in the industry. Now hold on, I'm bring this up to the camera. This nice little unit is their ambidextrous safety. It is so stout, so well made. When JR was building his gun, we didn't even have the sample of this yet, but there's a rumor going around that maybe this is gonna make its way to that guy's build. Not 100% sure, but what a great part, and JR's right, 
big things come in small packages. It's funny because you brought to light this company, mm -hmm. Ford Controls Design, and I was like, I've never heard of it, but I'm kind of a newbie, let's mm -hmm. face it. Then when we started hyping the February box, oh my gosh, the comments and the emails, wait, you've got FCD going in the next box? I need to sign up. Am I yeah. definitely, am I paid for? Am I good? Am I locked in for February? Yes. It kind of created a, a stir. When we, when we leak, I don't know if you want to say leaked or whatever, when we talked about that four controls is going to be in the February pack, people went nuts. And actually, board controls sent an email to their own email list that is, you know, it's not huge. It's a very strong, good uh, email list. And it, the reaction and the orders were through the roof. And in fact, we actually had record sales of new subscribers in January because we had all these new brands in the box, like Conceal Craft, like Ford Controls Design, like CMMG. So that's, that was our goal this year is to bring so many new companies into the TACPAC community. And uh, you know, the community gives us great feedback and we listen and we go out and we hunt down these products with these vendors, all just to bring them to everybody. And we get really excited. This year is gonna be a bunch of new products from a bunch of new companies and we're going to hopefully blow everyone's minds in the process. And I think that's why TACPAC has, you know, half the level of churn rate in a good way. So our subscribers at TACPAC stay for over double the average subscription box length. And again, that's kind of more of a business insight or whatever, but I think that says that the stuff we're putting out there is real and useful and professional grade from the top brands. And I think it's what keeps people in the community. So I'm very excited and proud uh, with the things that are going in the box. Always have been, but 2024 is the breakout year. 2024 feels like we are just really cooking with gas. And, and speaking of the March box um, coming up, you've, you've said, this is a very strong statement from this man right here. The plus item in the March box is the greatest item we've ever said. Yeah. His words, my words too. Well, now, now I'm going to have to, now when <laughs> pressure, gonna, if pressure. anybody doesn't like it, they're going to come roast me on this video. They're going to like it. It's something from Troy. Yeah. I'm um, really, really excited. It's, it's badass. It's probably, probably going on there. It's probably going on right. there. Right. I mean, yeah, yeah it's probably going right. on my build. That's how, that's how, you know, we are excited, excited. about this item. Item. Again, we haven't worked with Troy before. We're really excited to work with Troy. Um, is it an item or is it item? Item. Ah, but you know, there's a couple of people that are kind of reading between the lines on the internet yeah, okay. and guessing. Yeah, so if you we'll, find the wrong Instagram yeah. post, you might learn about what people are chattering about. Yeah, we'll calm down. But um, working with Troy is really exciting, and yeah, there it goes again. <laughs> um, we just want to bring really good products to everybody, and because the Tac Pack community has grown so much over the years, we've now got that purchasing power with these folks so that we can get these great items in the box. And then one more thing I want to, is it too early to talk about the Glock box? I, I think it's never too early. Okay. I think it's never too early. <laughs> the sixth iteration of the Glock box will go on pre-sale right around the time this video is coming out, you know, end of February. And it is by far, again, with the following that we've had with the Glock box through versions one through five, the sixth version of the Glock box is insanity. It is by far the best one we've ever put out. We're going to sell, you know, we're going to sell about a thousand of these. That's the goal. Yeah, they're, they'll probably sell out pretty fast, you know, a few weeks. The so. previous five have sold out within a month. Mm -hmm. So that gives you some history. This is the sixth version we've done. The previous five have sold out in less than a month from the time that we start selling them. Yeah. Um, lay it out real quick. There'll, there will be a standard version and a plus version similar to the monthly boxes. The standard version has $300 worth of gear. The plus version, it's the most expensive thing we've ever sold. Yes. But it's because it has $650 worth of Glock parts For and how accessories. Much money? You pay $349.99. Wow. But yeah. 
you're getting 650. It's gonna it's gonna take your your current Glock, whether you just have a, a basic Glock or you have one that already has a little razzle dazzle on it, and it's gonna kick it up several notches. 650 dollars worth of stuff from Aeronox, Swamp Fox. We have three items that are brand new to market made mm -hmm. items for the Glock box. American made three parts. Introducing them into the industry. Yep. So it's it's the high value, it's brand new parts. I mean, come on. It's awesome. We're very excited. Excited. <laughs> so yeah, link below, because by the time this video airs, we're gonna start selling these bad boys. So get in on the pre-order. They're gonna ship around mid to late April. So we're gonna start selling them. They're gonna sell out by the end of March. Probably, yeah. That's and then we're gonna ship them, ship them around the same time or shortly after we ship the April TAC pack. That's right. So yeah, there you go. That's kind of our spring plans. Spring forward. Let's spring ahead. <laughs> it's it's I'm, not that metaphorical. I'm constantly trying to do wordplay. It's all I do, it's all I do in my trying. life. Trying. So succeeding would be another thing. But all right, I'll look. cut it out. I quit. I'm done. Can't do this. Can't do this. All right. That's a, that's a wrap. I think we did good. Like all things, we hope you enjoyed the February Tack Pack Plus. March is going to have the best plus item we've ever sent. Really excited about it. Like all things, talk, talk soon. soon. We're excited. I'm excited. We're excited. Now, I need to keep this all away right. from you because... I did nothing wrong. I don't know if you really know how to work this type of hardware, my man. Like, this is a...